Hi there, Spark fans. Rob Reynolds here. If you've been following along with us, playing the Spark Fun home game, then you're familiar with our recent release of Micromod, the modular ecosystem of interchangeable processor and carrier boards that enable rapid prototyping and development. Now, since that initial release, we've continued to add processor and carrier boards. And this week, we're rolling out two more. A pair of boards that go together like baked brie and a Chilean Pinot Noir. Introducing the new SparkFun Micromod Asset Tracker Carrier Board and the SparkFun Micromod Update Tool. The Asset Tracker Carrier Board is built around the U-Block's Serra R510M8S module, which provides secure cloud LTEM and NB-IoT data communication for multi-regional use. The Serra R5 supports many different forms of data communication, from full TCP IP sockets and packet switch data through HTTP, GET, PUT, POST, FTP, the Sarah has a built-in file system, PING, and even good old SMS text messaging. It has an integrated M8 GNSS receiver for accurate positioning information. The board has an ICM 2948 IMU for 9 degree of freedom orientation and movement detection, located in the center of the board for easy frame of reference, and it supports wake on motion. There's also a nano SIM socket for the required hologram EUICC SIM card, which is included with the board. It's got an SPH0641 digital microphone for noise detection and a micro SD socket for data logging. The Micromod Asset Tracker can be powered by a LiPo battery and has both an MCP73831 battery charger and a MAX17048 battery fuel gauge. You can also power it via its USB-C connector or via breakout pins. There are two separate SMA connections for both LTE and GNSS antennas, and switchable 3.3 volt power should you want to use an active GNSS antenna. There's a quick connector for easily adding I2C sensors and peripherals, and LED indicators for power and Serra 5 on. And of course, what makes a Micromod board a Micromod board? The M.2 slot, allowing you to insert any of our Micromod processor boards. However, the Serra R5 module has options that you might want to communicate with directly using uBlox's sophisticated M-Center cellular evaluation software, which is why we're also offering the Micromod Update tool. Now, this processor module carries the CH340C USB serial converter, plus eight pairs of plated through-hole connections with split pad jumper links for serial transmit and receive, RTS, CTS, DTR, DSR, ring indicator, and data carrier detect. Now, these pins link directly to the Serra UART. Now the first thing one might want to do when getting this board is power it up, chuck it in a box, and ship it across the country, tracking it the whole way, and that'd be really cool. But just be aware that there are pretty severe safety measures in place when it comes to shipping LiPo batteries. So just make sure you know what those are before you drop this in your next package. Of course, asset tracking isn't just for packages. Your vehicles, your computers and IT equipment, your priceless antiquities. If it's something that you want to know where it is at all times, then you're going to want to create an asset tracker for it. And the new SparkFun Micromod Asset Tracker Carrier Board and the SparkFun Micromod Update Tool, or really any of our process boards, might just fit the bill perfectly. Pick up yours over at sparkfun.com, and as always, stay safe, be kind, and happy hacking! I don't know, I could have gone with maybe, they go together like peanut butter and jelly. But I found most Europeans like are disgusted by peanut butter and jelly, and I don't want to block out that entire market. It enable rapid prototyping and development. Now, they go together like like tomato and basil. Oh, a nice caprese. Processor and carrier boards. But that kind that needs like mozzarella, and so that wouldn't work. I just make sure you know what you are and you're not doing anything dangerous. Now I can't say that because I love doing dangerous stuff when I'm doing science. Okay, we'll change it to something else. I think the second one was better a little. I don't know. It's late. I don't know. You can fix it. Thanks, Cassie.